Here we are at the AMA certified testing facility about to conduct the forced entry resistance test. This test measures a window's ability to prevent break-ins by the burglar who's reluctant to make noise by smashing the glass. Initial testing is conducted with a screwdriver, pliers, and a putty knife. The technician attempts to gain access by taking apart the window, opening the lock, and finally pushing and pulling on the sash members. If the window passes each of these, testing proceeds. A simulated burglary in progress is shown here with AMA certified gauges and measuring devices. First we apply force in a single direction. A nylon strap connected to a spring gauge is wrapped around the bottom sash substitutes for a crowbar. The ratchet mechanism is activated until the spring gauge registers 150 pounds of force. Pressure is held for 60 seconds. This test is repeated on the top sash. Next, a secondary force is added to the inward or outward force on the upper or lower sash. Force is simultaneously applied to the meeting rail with a pressure gauge push rod pressed and held for 60 seconds at 75 pounds. In the final sequence, force is simultaneously applied vertically on the lock from the inside or the outside on the upper or lower sash and sideways towards the jam. This concludes the testing procedures for a window to meet a grade 10, which is sufficient and cost effective for the average low crime residential neighborhoods. In areas of higher crime, the specifier may wish to include testing to the grade 30 or grade 40 level, which addresses glass breakage.